9 10 a.m it'll be a six-year 90 dollars m contract for lemayu when finalized as was first reported by pat regazzo twitter link the 90 dollars m overall guarantee isn't particularly surprising but it is indeed an eye-opener to see that some come over a six-year term rather than five or even four years that Lemayu agreed to a lengthier pact as a boost for the Yankees, as the associated $15 M luxury hit will, only, put the team at about $195 M in terms of 2021 luxury tax obligations. That leaves the club with as much as $14.15 mm of space before reaching the $210 M luxury barrier. 8.52 AM. The Yankees' preference was indeed to drive down the luxury tax hit by lengthening the contract, tweets Bowden though the precise length of the deal still isn't clear. 8.17 a.m., The Athletics' Jim Bowden tweets that Lemayu's contract will be more than four years in length. That makes a five-year deal seem likeliest, barring an unexpected six-year arrangement at a comparable total but lower annual rate that is designed to lessen the luxury hit for the Yankees. 7.04 a.m., After a month's long stare-down, the Yankees are closing in on a new contract with second baseman DJ Lemayu, reports John Morosi of MLB.com, via Twitter. Terms of the potential agreement aren't yet known, but the deal could be completed as soon as today, per Morosi. Lemayu is represented by Wasserman. Lemayu, 32, has been the Yankees' top priority all season. General Manager Brian Cashman acknowledged as much a couple of weeks back, but the club has also seemingly been letting Lemayu explore his options on the open market rather than emulating the Yankees of old and simply writing him a blank check up front. The interest between the two parties was mutual, and it's long been apparent that the Yankees would have the opportunity to match any offer Lemayu received elsewhere. The impending reunion will surely come at a loftier price than his initial deal, which proved to be a bargain. Reports have recently suggested that Lemayu has been looking to top Josh Donaldson's four-year, $92 M contract, ideally on a five-year arrangement. The focus on Lemayu is more than understandable for the Yankees, who looked like an oddball fit for the longtime Rockies second baseman two years ago when he inked a two-year, $24 M contract to come to the Bronx. The Yankees already boasted a relatively full infield, but injuries and Lemayu's immediate, career-best production quickly thrust him into regular work in manager Aaron Boone's lineup. The versatile Lemayu locked action not only at second base but also at the infield corners, emerging